Hey guys, it's Kaler. Welcome to the YouTube channel. This week we got a new update for Adobe XD. So that's what we're gonna be taking a look at in today's video. This is the June 2021 update. This month we got three new features. So let's dive in to Adobe XD and take a look at them. The first feature this month is outline stroke, allowing you to convert a stroke into a shape. So if I create a line on this artboard, for example, I normally am only allowed to adjust the border color of this and it's just a line. If I wanted to convert this to a shape, however, I can go up to object, path, and outline stroke. So now this is an edible shape and it has a fill so I can change that to whatever color I would like. And I can also even add a border to this and it just behaves like a normal shape. So that's the first feature, outline stroke. Next up, we now have inner shadow. So we've had drop shadow for a while, but now we can actually use inner shadow, which just allows you to add an inner shadow to an object to make it look like it's behind or sunken into the screen or the artboard. So that's located right in the effects panel when you select an object right above where drop shadow used to be. You can now add that and you have the same values that you did with drop shadow. You have the X offset, the Y offset, and then the blur, and then you can change the inner shadow color, as well as the opacity. The last feature we have is the angular gradient. So you can fill components with an angular gradient to design things like pie charts and color pickers. You can also add this to just any regular shape. So if I add this to this rectangle, I can go to the fill and now in the drop down, we have the addition of angular gradient. And you can see that it gives me two colors by default and I can add colors onto this wheel and create a nice angular gradient that goes around in a circular pattern around the center of my object. And I can adjust the start and stop of this as well to create some interesting gradients inside of Adobe XD. I can also adjust each individual color here by just dragging them around to get my desired effect. So those are the three new features for the June update to Adobe XD, outline stroke, inner shadow, and angular gradient. Let me know what you guys think of this update down in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you give it a like, subscribe for more design and Adobe XD related content, and as always, have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.